You for keeping it real? Nora's not your wife. Not since she started looking at your brother. I know. But I hate her for that. You still love her. You know she's not coming back. And you gotta start taking care of yourself. Make yourself happy. That means getting back in the saddle. <laughs> so what you're saying is... Giddy up. Well, thanks, Vicki. Okay. I'll get right on it. I'm all right. Okay, Nigel said that Clint came home a little while ago, so thank God he's yeah. all right. Did you talk to him? No, he told Nigel he didn't want to be disturbed. And besides, this isn't the kind of thing you can tell him over the phone. No, no, it isn't. Look, yeah, I'm going to get over there. Um, Bo, I... I mm, maybe this is something that I should do. I mean, let's face it, he doesn't want to see either one of us, but there are other things that you could be doing. Yeah, I guess. Uh... Are you ready to face him? Oh, please. What's the worst that could happen? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe you need to get out of town. Go somewhere new. Let the rest of the family worry about the business for a while. Take a vacation. By myself? Sure. Why not? You love to shoot things. Go shoot something big. <laughs> Like an elephant or something. <laughs> you want me to go to Africa? I want you to cheer the hell up. And if that means that you have to take some time for yourself, lick your wounds a little. No, that's not my style. Now me, I jump on someone new. There's nothing that'll ease your pain like a warm body. so sure about that. <laughs> we are going to get caught, and you are going to get canned. Mm, never happened. They love me here. Who's they? Everybody. <laughs> Besides, you've seen those hospital dramas. They catch us making out, and the next thing you know, I am chief of staff. Oh, God help the hospital. What are you talking about? I'd make a great chief of staff. I turn this place upside down. You don't, I know it. <laughs> mm. Mm. But I have to get going soon. Oh, no, no, no. We're supposed to have dinner together. I have to catch up with Daya. What, is Danielle still missing? No, they found her, and she's okay. But it's complicated. And I think Taya could use my help. Taya. Hi. Vicky, I am so sorry. I, I heard I was with Todd when he heard about Jessica. Is there anything that I can do? I, I know, I don't know. I, I don't think there is anything. It seems all we can do is just pray and wait for news. Where is everyone? Well, Natalie went to the police station because without Bo being there, you know, they won't tell us anything on the phone. And where's Charlie? Uh, Charlie would be here if, if he could. I just wish Clint would get here. You want me in bed with you? No, that's not what I meant. I just, I figured you could use some sleep and this is your bed after all. Yeah, I don't think that's such a good idea. Mm. Uh, why not? It's not like we'd be cheating on anyone and I'm not gonna come on to you. You're not. I'm pregnant, all right? I don't exactly feel like whipping out spikes and pasties. Yeah, that would be a little... Ugly? Yeah. You're not ugly, Stacy. You're pregnant, it's beautiful. Really? All pregnant women are beautiful. Oh. Well, anyway, if you wanna bunk with me and Lil' Kim or Lil' Bo, you're welcome to. I get to bond with baby all day. You hardly ever get any daddy time. Don't you wanna cuddle up to your little kid? We were just talking about you. Come in. Thanks. 
What's going on? I'm sorry, Balsam. Your sister Jessica's missing. I'm so sorry to barge in, but I... Oh, my God.